today is um, Sunday, September 9th, 2018, and just um, giving you guys another update on the PET scan results and what's coming up next. So, Friday, Joe had his PET scan and everything went fine. Um, they shot him with the um, with the radioactive radioactive dye that will light up where um, other areas of the cancer is, and they did. They were able to see the primary source, which was is in his tonsil area um, doesn't mean that they're just going to take out tonsils because cancer gets into the tissue also of the tonsil area so it's not just localized to the tonsils so the primary source where it began was his tonsils and this again is a strain of HPV it has nothing to do with um, health and um, like in smoking and drinking, which we all know that Joe is not a smoker, never has been, or a drinker much. So it is from the HPV strain. It's really complicated. Basically, um, it's showing up a lot in males and now, um, and basically his body was not able to fight off that strain that causes the cancer of the orpharyngeal or something like that. It's the oral uh, mouth, throat, um, tongue sometimes. And then it obviously from the tonsils, it metastasized to his lymph node in his neck. So Tuesday, we will be going to the radiology, Dr. Jabari, um, doctor to see what's next, which probably will be the feeding tube, um, scheduling, and then also the radiation treatment plan, which should be five days a week, seven weeks, I believe, but we'll find out. And then we also will probably be setting up an appointment with the chemo doctor, Dr. Mira, and seeing if he still is only at one day a week for chemo, which that's what he's hoping and of course I'm hoping um, we've been putting together um, notes and diet plans and um, things like that to keep him as healthy as possible um, and he's been starting some supplements um, to keep himself healthy healthy trying to wean himself off of his soda he does love soda so he's trying to wean himself off of that because um, he doesn't want to have headaches and whatnot uh, during his radiation, um, just kidding, quitting cold turkey. So he is trying to wean off of that. Um, he's in really good spirits. He's uh, still working. Um, and we're just enjoying doing things like eating out and hanging out with the kids and just um, preparing for this crappy journey that we're going to be on for a couple months. So that's basically it. Primary cancer is in the tonsils with his secondary in the lymph node um, of his right side of his neck. So um, when I have an update for everyone um, and with further treatment, then I will um, update it. I will upload another video. Um, so for now, that's basically our update on what's going on um, with us. And um, I'm hoping to put together um, a video of things that were regimens that we're going to be doing and, um, you know, information about the feeding tube for those of you that are going through this and are watching this channel just for information on what it's like and radiation and stuff i will try and do my best to convey that to you i will try and get joe to eventually um answer some of my questions on this but i can't promise that but uh anyway i hope this is 
helpful to all of you. And again, just want to thank friends and family for all of your prayers and your sweet messages and all of your support and love. I mean, we are truly blessed to have you all supporting us and loving us. And Joe is very thankful and he says it many times a day and lets me know who's texting him and I'm sending their um, prayers and support. So we love you all and just thank you so much for um, having us in your thoughts and prayers. Uh, Go love on your loved ones as much as possible and until next time, thanks.